Vedic mathematics. So what is the Vedic mathematics? Most probably most of the people are going to just confuse that. What is the Vedic mathematics? What is the use of the Vedic mathematics? And as well as why we need to use the Vedic mathematics. So general mathematics also there. Why we need this kind of special mathematics? And what is the age distinctions? So everything, so most of the people have the confusion about the, uh, in our general life we have the different type of courses are there. Why we choose this kind of Vedic mathematics? Is it any extra or other than the textbooks or any other? So most probably all questions are like this. So but one solution for this. Vedic mathematics is our mathematics, our traditional mathematics. So, okay, most probably one more question is also arising in their mind. Sir, our traditional mathematics is normal method. So, normally, the so 2 to the 4 and like this. So, this kind of method is there. Why we need to, uh, why we said that is a Vedic mathematics is our mathematics. So, actually, so before Second World War, all people they used as Vedic mathematics only our mathematics. Other country people they entered to our after Second World War, they implemented their mathematics, their calculations. So, okay, whatever it may be, our what we are using that mathematics is a good mathematics. I don't want to just comment on it. But one thing, why we need to choose this kind of the Vedic mathematics again in the nowadays? Definitely, it should be implementing so in competitive world. So, because of the reason, competitive world, we need to just change our thinking, nature, and calculation time. We need to just reduce the calculation time. Then only we will get the success. Whatever it may be, in a small age to the elder. Most probably, most of the people are using as a calculators or cell phones to calculate the simple calculations also. Simple calculations also they are using as a so calculator. Or otherwise they will confuse. In addition also most probably the people they confuse and they are not giving a proper answer within fraction of seconds in the simple additions. I observe. And that's why is a Vedic mathematics is very simple. Now you say which age people is suitable. So your answer is each and every person, those who are ready to need the mathematical calculations is a small age to elders age around 60 years age people also are ready to learn because of the reason if they are uh, communicate with other people they are working any company or they are so uh, is a small industry people or any shop people each and every people by using of this Vedic mathematics they can learn and not only the shop people and industry people age people the small kids they are going to school. So they need to just calculate the simple calculations. They can use this kind of Vedic mathematics 100% useful. For example, I will say for that introduction purpose, I am going to say that what is the beauty of Vedic mathematics. One see here. The Vedic mathematics beauty means, for example, 98 and sorry, 97. So this calculation we need to calculate in a traditional mathematical wise so it takes some time so whatever it may be how many people know is the calculation 7 8s are 7 9s are 9 8s are 9 9s are after that you should add is a 2 to 3 steps we need but mathematical calculation takes some time but basic mathematics within one step or within fraction of seconds we can do it you see here this is a 2 is left from the 100 and 3 is left from 100. Then see here, this is a minus 98 minus 3 means 95. 3 to the 6 is a 0, 06. See the, how the simple we can do it. The 95 0, 06. If you multiply with 98 into 97, in our, our using traditional mathematics, also it takes some time, let's say, fraction of minutes. But it is a fraction of seconds. So that is the beauty of the Vedic mathematics. So we will discuss the Vedic mathematics as some addition to the big calculations. So this kind of calculations at a time, so most of the people they ask the questions also. Sir, 
this kind of trick is useful to all members to so know if the process is there. So we need to use some kind of tricks to the some special category members only. All calculations are not useful. In this course, we need to explain that step by step: addition, subtraction, multiplications, and divisions. Each and everything I am going to explain to so each and every student can understand and can do the in our material session. We will give a materials to you and uh, exercise problems also will give and you can do the problems and you can get more knowledge. If in your organization, whatever it may be, a school or college or any industry or anything, you can do apply this kind of calculations to your regular mathematics. Definitely within fraction of seconds you will do it. That's why most probably those who are right to attending in a concrete exams that people can learn. So most of the people uh, will get the calculations problems. The mathematics, why all people are going to feel fear the calculation problem only because of the reason formula is not a problem they will keep in their mind. But calculation wise, calculations are a bigger problem. If they will calculate and if they will get any small mistake then they won't get the proper answer. That's why they feel that it is a difficult subject. We are ready to remove that kind of problems. We will follow the way the mathematics. So, this is called as a one more word, it is also there. Sometimes some people they may call as a Vedic mathematics or some kind of people they will call as a mental mathematics or some kind of people as called as a math shortcuts. So these are the different different type of wording they are using. So we will discuss, we will continue to learn the step by step, right?